Okay, so what we have here, we got to do some uh, dent pulling on aluminum, which is, of course, different from steel because uh, aluminum is, is more conductive as a, as a metal, and therefore we need a different equipment than we do with steel. This is a AL5, the ProSpot AL5, which is a capacitor discharge unit. And as you can see, this, this little threaded stud is made out of aluminum, and it has a little point at the end that actually going to initiate the electric arc and as I put this in here and I go to the dented area and as you can see as I brush this surface off there's a lot of oxidation so aluminum have a lot of oxidation so we clean clean that off and then uh, as I enter the stud into the dent quickly discharge of the power without going through the metal even though the aluminum here is 0.9 millimeters thin so let's say so now I have a good grab a good hold on uh, on this so then I can use this hook here that actually simply threads onto the stud and now I have a good anchor to pull so then there's different methods of how to pull I can put several of them in a row like this and uh, can do one more here right next to it. So let's say if the dent is, is deeper or longer, I can keep adding these um, anywhere. Okay. So then I can use this kind of a pulling device here that uh, can grab this. This is a single pull, and we have different pull adapters that if you have a longer then I can I can use this type of polling to get the whole area out but the principle is pretty simple so all I do is I, I find adjust this here and then as um, as I have this hook going into the anchor here I can start pulling and you can see how now I put a lot of pressure on the stud here but aluminum is very brittle so what this nut does is I can actually freeze the pull here so now I got two more hands to work with. At the same time, I have a lot of pressure on this area. So that's where we come in and do the heating. And we can heat the area here with simply using a, uh, a heat gun. And then we have a laser thermometer here that we can measure the temperature as we heat up the area. When we come to a certain temperature it's very hard to even uh, heat it more than 300 degrees or something like that but you don't need a whole lot for it to start moving up okay under pressure so uh, you know when they stamp this at the factory the aluminum is a lot softer and then they dip it and heat treat them and through through the assembly process so when that's otherwise it would be very easy to to get then so it's pretty hard surface right now so then I can add more pressure lock it again and then I can use <coughs> different hammers that are made out of aluminum because we don't want to contaminate the area so we use aluminum hammers for aluminum surfaces so then I can work the stress relief and you can you can see the then coming out and then I'm done, you simply release and remove the pulling device. Remove this part here. And then uh, you actually cut this part off, the pair of dikes. And then, and then you simply, um, since I don't have the cutter here, but you can see, then you simply... <laughs> And then you're down to the metal finish after you cut them off. So that's principle. That's the principle of aluminum dent pulling using the ProSpot AL5, which is a capacitor discharge unit.